Well, I got two Super Bowl rings and a college championship ring, and I never won anything in college. So you don't always have to play the game mm -hmm. to be able to get part of the prize. Most people don't do this. Most people come in and talk to you about playing football and you turn it in, making it to the NFL. I tell you that if you love the game of sports, I don't care what sport it is, football, basketball, baseball, hockey, track, I don't care. There are many, many jobs in those sports. Winning is all attitude. Mighty Florida Gators, y'all ever heard of them? When I was there, we ain't winning any championship. But because of what I did in the classroom, the way I trained my mind, I went back and did broadcast work for 20 years for them. So I got a national championship ring without even playing. See, there's a lot of great athletes that never reach their goals because what? They never graduate. How do I get smarter and better? Smarter and better. I didn't say better and smarter. I say smarter and better. The only thing in life you can ever attain that nobody can take back is knowledge. Knowledge is power, young man. Knowledge is everything. So every time you go to class, you're training your brain to be successful on the field as well as in the classroom. They can take these rings. They can take the money in my pocket. They can even take my wife. <laughs> but they can't get what's up here. Once you get it, it's yours. You get to keep it, and you get to use it. And this is the 50th year of the Super Bowl. And the NFL came up with this brilliant idea, and I do mean brilliant, because once again, it's an opportunity to give back to the schools that develop the talent and to say thank you. A lot has been given to me, so it's an opportunity for me to have a platform to do good for others and hopefully make an impact in their lives as well. I get to come back to the high school that developed me and say, thank you. I get to come back and say to you young men, I haven't done anything that you can't do. Stay in the game, gentlemen.